Hi, this is Nelly Deutsch, and today I'm going to show you what Moodle 3.9 with Fordson looks like when it comes to the discussion forms. So many of you have experienced different things with different themes and different Moodle versions when it comes to subscribing or getting email notifications. So the notifications is still more or less the same. That means that when you go into your profile, you can set the preferences for the notifications. However, in this case, you still need to take another step. And let me show you what it is. I'm going to go into my courses and uh, notice I've got lots of courses here. I'm going to go into self care for educators. It's by alphabetical order, which makes it a lot easier. And, um, I'm in. So let me just, um, do the editing and this is what it looks like all right so this is one theme but there are other themes of course and this is one course layout and there are different kinds of course layouts that you can use even in this course so let me go into activities now i've added the activities blocks to make it easier for participants to be able to subscribe to all the discussion forms or at least to whatever discussion form they wish so i'm going to go to the right here this is where i added the uh, block the activity block if you want to know more about the activity block let me know but there are the forms going to click on all the forms and this is where i get a chance to view all the forms and decide which one i'd like to subscribe to so notice i always subscribe to all since i want to know what's going on my curiosity gets the better of me all right and you might want to do the same because you do want to respond to your colleagues so now you notice that i'm subscribed to all however you can also do this individually decide that you don't want to be subscribed to the announcements and then that becomes a no hope you saw that because i'm going to turn it into a yes because that's one of the most important uh, forms and that's the announcements okay so let's continue here all right let's go on to okay so we're going to continue by going into individual ones so let me uh, go into this one this is a support form you might not want to subscribe to that one i do because i want to support but notice what's here and this is new under subscribe this is something new for each of the discussions notice it says subscribe now you have an option notice right now i've added subscribe but i can undo the subscribe for these uh, individual discussion forms okay so i can turn that off okay let me turn it back on now this one is an old post so i'm going to turn it off i'm not really keen on getting notified that someone has added that anything to that discussion form now notice something else too let me go back into the course and into uh, other discussion forms let me go into week one there and scroll down as i go into a um, discussion form this one now notice there are a lot of um, posts okay these are posts so uh, if i go into one of them okay and uh, in this case i cannot subscribe but if i go back to the main i'll be able to subscribe over here okay so notice you can subscribe or unsubscribe as you wish to individual and this is really nice individual posts this is something new not the whole discussion form but to individual posts right here okay so it's up to you and that's it about the new things of course if you go into the top right here and into your profile or your preferences you can go to your profile and then your preferences or straight into your preferences you'll be able to notice here there's message preferences and there's notifications so these are really important notice form preferences all these preferences take a look at them it, they might help you so notification preferences notice what i have here uh, notice you've got email 
online and offline. When you're offline, you want to be notified by email, web. Now, if you want to be modified on the web, you'll get this. I don't really like that. So let me get rid of that, whether I'm on or off. I So let's scroll down until we get to the form. So the form is here. That's what we're interested in. So let me turn that off so I don't see those. Subscribed form digest. Okay, and um, so now it's green. Me green means it's off. Okay, and when you click on it and it's red, it means it's on. It's hot. It's on. Okay, so let me refresh because the numbers get bigger and bigger and kind of annoys me. Okay, so that should be off very soon. Okay, there, that's off. It should be off really soon. And that's it. hope this has been of help. If you have any questions, feel free to add them to the comment box uh, below and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.